Ever felt like there's more to history than what's written in textbooks? You're not alone. History books may capture the essence of iconic moments, but they often leave out the hidden treasures, the rare photos that unveil untold stories. We invite you to explore 66 rare photos that were kept out of the history books. It's time to reveal the secrets you weren't taught in school. Number 66. Circus Act Many don't know that circuses rose to popularity during the Victorian era. The Victorian period circuses were not just entertainment, they were a significant part of culture. The events during this period included Chinese jugglers, clowns, female acrobats, even child performers. Take a look at this incredible photo captured in 1891. It shows a young girl balancing on another girl while biking on a high-wheel bicycle. Can you imagine the thrill of being in the audience back then? Number 65. Alligator Action How far would you go to get that perfect picture? Well, in 1950, Ginger Stanley, a secretary and model, took it to the extreme. She sat above a pit of alligators for an advertising campaign. Surprisingly, Stanley looks completely at ease and camera ready while the alligators beneath her climb to reach her dangling foot. Talk about a nerve-wracking photo session. Number 64. Burmese Meet the British During the 1930s, while the U.S. was facing its worst financial crisis, live circus shows were all the rage in England. One of the most popular attractions during this time was the giraffe women, who were women from Burma who used metal rings to stretch out their necks. In this rare photo, a group of Burmese women from the Karen tribe can be seen asking a British police officer for directions. Number 63 Touring the West The Padang, a minority ethnic group from Burma, are recognized for wearing brass coils around their necks. In the 1930s, circus acts became extremely popular in the UK, and the Padang women, who were advertised as giraffe women, became star attractions. Here we have a fascinating image of Padang women standing beside a grenadier guard. Number 62. The Last Known Thylacine the thylacine species, also known as Tasmanian tigers, went extinct in 1936, when the last known thylacine died in captivity. Benjamin, the thylacine in this photo, was found in the wild in 1933, and was kept at the Hobart Zoo in Australia until his tragic passing. This unique animal met a heartbreaking end, left completely exposed outside on a cold night, ultimately freezing to death. Number 61. Goodbye, Lover In this emotional photo, we see a woman kissing her boyfriend goodbye as he goes off to war. It's a poignant moment captured in New York, just before a busload of soldiers were taken off to defend the United States. A fellow soldier helps the two lovebirds by hoisting the girl up to reach her love. Number 60. Skiing in Style Have you ever seen an elephant in the ocean? How about an elephant water skiing? Well, in 1958, Marge Rusing and her sidekick Betty Hamid took water skiing to a whole new level on the Hudson River. Despite the apparent risk of this stunt, Rusing looks remarkably confident and at ease as she glides on water skis, with an elephant in tow. In the background, you can catch a glimpse of the Palisades Amusement Park, where this incredible spectacle was part of the circus. Talk about skiing in style. Number 59. Gnarly Nails Traveling circuses were all the rage in the 1950s, captivating audiences around the globe with their daring acts. Here, we see a pair of performers demonstrating an incredibly dangerous act, lying on a bed of sharp nails. The act required the performer to lie down on a sheet of sharp nails while an additional sheet was pressed into their front side. Miraculously, they emerged from this ordeal unscathed. Number 58. Gas Mask Gaze In March 1939, a new invention hit the market. Gas masks designed specifically for babies under two years old. These baby gas masks, also known as baby helmets, allowed mothers to slip the cover over their child's head and shoulders and strap the mechanism firmly to their chest, sealing it from contaminated air. 
When this invention was released, mothers were taught how to fit the mask to their child's body. Number 57. Magical Escape In 1967, Steve Baker, an escape artist and magician, achieved a feat that outdid even the legendary Harry Houdini. On February 23rd, Baker hung from a special hoist on the Oakland Tribune Tower and managed to escape from a straitjacket in just nine seconds. Houdini had performed the same stunt 44 years earlier, but Baker's daring performance took place one floor higher. Number 56. One Man, No Job The Great Depression, lasting from 1929 to 1939, was the worst economic downturn in the history of the industrialized world. It began after the stock market crashed in October 1929 leading to a major decline in consumer spending and investment, causing a steep drop in production. By 1933, a staggering 15 million Americans were unemployed, and nearly all of the country's banks had failed. This poignant photo captures the essence of the era, depicting a man standing in a long line. Number 55. Returning to the Annex World War II left an indelible mark on history, and one of the most well-known figures from that period is Anne Frank, known for her diary documenting her family's struggles during the war. After the war, Anne Frank's father, Otto Frank, discovered her diary and decided to publish it, making their story globally famous. However, this rare photo remained hidden from the public eye for years. It captures Otto Frank's poignant return to the annex where his family had hidden for 25 months. Number 54. Kissing Craze In 1945, as World War II came to an end, soldiers finally returned home to their anxious and relieved wives. Understandably, the women couldn't contain their excitement and risked it all to reach their heroic husbands. In this captivating photo, Marlena Dietrich is held up by soldiers to reach her husband. While history books often feature images of soldiers returning home, this particular photo captures the intense emotions of the moment and the passionate reunions that took place, which might have been left out of many accounts. Number 53. Self-Tanning Service In 1949, despite the U.S. facing financial challenges, people were eager to invest in intriguing vending machine inventions. These self-service machines covered a wide range of needs, including suntan vending machines. At the annual vending machine convention in Chicago, Betty Dutter, a famous model at the time, demonstrated how the spray nozzle worked. She explained that for just a dime and in just 30 seconds, individuals could get a full spray tan. It's interesting to note that this self-tanning service was invented 20 years before the ATM. Number 52. Swedes Switching Sides Sweden is renowned for having the highest GDP per capita in the EU. But in a surprising turn of events, on Sunday, September 3, 1967, the country switched from driving on the left-hand side of the road to driving on the right-hand side. This photo captures the confusion and chaos this change caused. The transition cost the country a substantial amount of money and time, as traffic lights had to be reversed, road signs changed, and road lines repainted. Number 51. Pool Attire As tensions rose before World War II officially broke out in 1939, British residents were warned about the potential for mass bombings in the event of war. This led to various drills to prepare for such an eventuality, causing people to walk around with their gas masks at the ready on a daily basis. This photo captures a pre-war family sporting gas masks as they head to the Empire Pool in Wembley, London. Number 50. Berlin Wall Escape In 1961, the world watched in shock as the Berlin Wall, a symbol of division and oppression, was erected physically dividing West Berlin from East Berlin and East Germany. This photo captures a woman's daring attempt to escape from the western side of Berlin after the city's division. Historical records reveal a heartbreaking truth. At least 140 people lost their lives while attempting to cross the border from East Germany into West Germany in pursuit of freedom. Number 49. 
laughing lung. During the 1950s, the world faced the height of the polio epidemic, a disease that caused severe respiratory issues and often led to death. Medical experts devised an incredible invention known as the iron lung, a tank respirator that allowed polio patients to breathe as normally as possible. In this touching photograph, a young boy finds solace in reading a comic book while enclosed within the iron lung. Number 48. Swimming in the City The summer of 1975 brought a unique and refreshing experience to the residents of New York City, the introduction of swim mobiles. These were mobile swimming pools attached to trucks parked on city streets during the day and towed away at night. A 1976 New York Times article reports that the city owned five of these mobile pools, primarily located in underserved areas. Interestingly, this period coincided with a wave of middle-class residents moving to the suburbs, which strained the city's tax revenue. Despite financial challenges, the city still managed to allocate resources for these pools, providing a much-needed escape from the summer heat for its residents. Number 47 Hippo-Drawn Carriage While history books often feature images of horse-drawn carriages, this extraordinary photograph captures an unprecedented sight, a baby hippopotamus harnessed to a carriage. In 1923, a daring individual managed to harness this baby hippo to his carriage. The story behind the unusual pairing remains shrouded in mystery. Number 46. Jackie the Lion have you ever wondered how Metro-Goldwyn-Mayer, MGM, captured the iconic lion's roar for its legendary opening credits? In 1928, during the production of MGM's first talking movie, White Shadows in the South Seas, the film crew constructed a soundstage around the lion and recorded his roar using a gramophone. Unfortunately, tragedy struck the next day when Jackie the Lion turned on his trainer. Number 45 sitting on Santa's lap. In this heartwarming photo from 1937, a little girl sits on Santa's lap in a store, surrounded by dolls, a month before Christmas. The modern image of Santa Claus as we know him today became mainstream at the beginning of the 1930s. Children had been visiting Santa's lap since the 1890s to make their Christmas present requests. This timeless tradition continues to bring joy to children and families during the holiday season. Number 44. Goodbye, Grandparents. The year 1961 marked the construction of the Berlin Wall, which physically divided West Berlin from East Berlin and East Germany. In areas where there was no wall, barbed wire barricades were erected. Tragically, this separation led to the division of several families, who were forced to interact over the barricades. This poignant photo captures two little girls chatting with their grandparents through the barbed wire. The division had not only emotional, but also significant financial effects on the country, including its stock market and banking systems. Number 43. Robin Williams, the cheerleader. Robin Williams, known for his exceptional comedic talent, surprised fans in 1979 when he dressed up as a Broncos Pony Express cheerleader and ran onto the field with his team. Although this was done for filming purposes, this rare photo showcases Williams in a unique and unexpected role. The image was captured at Denver's Mile High Stadium. Number 42. Rare Recordings in the early 1900s, before the advent of modern recording studios and smartphone apps, phonographs were used to record important interviews and events. Frances Densmore, a pioneering figure, dedicated her career to recording and preserving the musical culture of Native Americans. She invited tribal chiefs to her recording studio to document their music. This photo captures Frances in action recording the music of the Blackfoot tribe. Her work played a crucial role in preserving the rich musical heritage of indigenous communities. Number 41. Children's Play Following the tragic events of World War I, experts predicted that future wars would involve large-scale bombings. To prepare its citizens, Britain established air raid precautions. 
This photograph, taken in 1938, features two British children at play. The little girl wears a gas mask, symbolizing the need to protect against potential bombing attacks. Number 40. Leaping Nurse In 1940, during the tumultuous years of World War II, a group of Red Cross nurses found a way to stay fit and maintain their spirits by playing a lively game of leapfrog. Stationed in England, these nurses played games and engaged in exercises like this to ensure they remained physically fit to aid soldiers. Number 39. Miss America Protest The feminist movement reached its zenith in the 1960s, with women becoming increasingly liberated and participating in protests worldwide. In 1968, feminists took to the streets to protest the Miss America pageant and its patriarchal stance. This iconic photo shows women setting fire to their brassieres and undergarments to make a powerful statement against traditional beauty standards. That same year was also marked by significant economic challenges, often attributed to rising inflation and high unemployment. Number 38. Sibling Support Toward the end of World War II, tensions ran high between the Japanese and American armies. In 1942, Japanese individuals were placed in isolated camps throughout America. This photo, taken in 1944, portrays a young Japanese girl carrying her infant brother on her back and clutching a bottle of water in an American camp for citizens of Saipan. Number 37. Goodbye, Girls This poignant photograph captures two young girls aboard a train clutching their dolls tightly as they are evacuated from London in 1940. London faced intense bombing by the German army during this period, leading to widespread evacuation of children to safer areas in the western part of the country. Number 36. Soldiers' Duties During World War II, the city of London faced a series of devastating bombings. Civilians often had to be rescued from the rubble of their destroyed homes. In this photo from 1944, a compassionate soldier saves a young girl named Barbara James from the ruins of her home after an aerial bombing. Throughout the Second World War, approximately 30,000 London residents lost their lives due to bombing attacks. Number 35. Fire Feast Famous magician and performer Lee Roy Neal demonstrates the art of fire eating by plunging burning torches down his throat in his magical classroom. Neal was a highly skilled performer, although he occasionally suffered burns to his mouth and lips during his daring performances. Fire eating has a long history, dating back thousands of years, with the earliest recorded instances dating as far back as 133 BCE. Number 34. Niagara Nearly Frozen Niagara Falls, one of the world's most iconic natural wonders, has fully frozen over only once in recorded history. This extraordinary event occurred in 1848 due to an ice jam, causing the famous falls to freeze completely. Since that remarkable occurrence, Niagara Falls has only partially frozen over during periods of exceptionally cold weather, as captured in this photo from 1896. Number 33. Cuddling Cubs In 1937, a heartwarming scene unfolds as a group of eight-week-old tiger cubs playfully climbs on top of their zookeeper at Whipsnade Zoo in Bedfordshire, England. Whipsnade Zoo, which opened in 1931, remains open to this day. During World War II, many animals from the London Zoo were transferred to Whipsnade for their safety. Number 32. Fox for a Cause At the young age of 18, Terry Fox was diagnosed with bone cancer, resulting in the amputation of his right leg. While receiving treatment in the hospital, Fox was deeply moved by the suffering of fellow cancer patients, particularly children. This experience became the catalyst for his life's mission, to run across Canada and raise money for cancer research. After an incredible 143 days and 5,373 kilometers, or 3,339 miles, Fox was informed that the disease had spread to his lungs, forcing him to halt his run. Tragically, the Canadian hero passed away shortly thereafter. Number 31. 
Baby Queen In this rare photo from 1927, a young Princess Elizabeth is seen taking a ride around Windsor Castle as just a one-year-old. Little did anyone know that this royal toddler would go on to become the longest reigning British monarch in history until her death in 2022. Number 30. Oxygen Tent Pictured here are Dr. DJ Wayne and Anne Chamney with their innovative invention, a high-content, low-cost oxygen tent designed at the University College Hospital in London. This unique tent was tested on a life-sized doll as part of its development. The invention aimed to provide efficient oxygen therapy in a cost-effective manner. Number 29. Lying with Lions American actress and model Tippi Hedren is captured at her home in California in 1971, posing with her pet lion named Neil. Hedren's fascination with lions developed during an on-location shoot in Africa. Remarkably, she transformed her family ranch into an animal sanctuary where she and her family lived in close proximity to lions and other big cats. Number 28. Scary Stories In this intriguing photograph, a female nurse finds solace in a piece of chocolate as she reads a particularly chilling crime novel called Phantom Lady, written by Cornell Woolrich under the pseudonym William Irish in 1942. The story revolves around a man accused of murdering his wife, with a missing alibi adding to the suspense. Number 27. Doctor Duties Acupuncture, an integral part of traditional Chinese medicine, involves the insertion of thin needles into specific points on the body to relieve pain and stress. In this photograph from 1934, acupuncture is administered on a random side street. Number 26. Olive Oatman Olive Ann Oatman's story is a remarkable but lesser-known chapter in American history. At the age of 14, she was kidnapped by a Native American tribe, the Mojave. Upon her arrival, Oatman was marked with a distinctive blue tattoo on her chin. After five years of captivity, rumors of Oatman living with the Mojave reached her home village, leading to her eventual trade for blankets and horses. Notably, Olive Oatman became the first American woman to have a tattoo. Number 25. Hair Horrors In this intriguing photo, it appears as though a man is connecting a woman's head to a perplexing machine that might be capable of brain extraction. However, the contraption is actually a hairdressing device. This unusual machine was used to give women permanent waves for their hair. Number 24. No Elephants on the Bus In 1938, a rather unexpected passenger surprised busgoers in London. As the bus picked up passengers on Shaftesbury Avenue, an elephant from Chesington Zoo named Comet decided to join the ride. Comet was scheduled to perform at the Trocadero during the Christmas season. It seems that the bus wasn't quite prepared for this unusual cargo and it's safe to say that it didn't have a license for such an exotic passenger. Number 23. Wigging Out In a creative marketing stunt from 1969, a model named Holly O'Neill was enlisted to showcase the world's longest wig by Godiva. Sporting the incredibly long locks, Holly O'Neill took on the role of posting a letter, going barefoot for the occasion. This attention-grabbing spectacle certainly turned heads and made quite the statement about the lengths people would go for fashion. Number 22. Child's Play This perfectly timed photo captures a young girl using a farm yoke to carry her two dolls. While most young girls play with their dolls in dollhouses or strollers, this girl had a unique approach, chaining her two toy companions together for transport. It's an unconventional but imaginative way to move dolls from place to place, surely causing passersby to do a double take. Number 21. Tight Fit British Airways Limited, a British airline company that operated in Europe from 1935 to 1939, found itself facing an unusual challenge in 1937. Primo Carnera, an Italian professional boxer and world's heavyweight champion at the time, had to squeeze himself into a British Airlines airplane. 
Despite his imposing size, Carnera managed to make it onto the plane, but it's clear that it was a tight fit. Number 20. Laying in the Lung between 1933 and 1955, the iron lung was a critical device for treating individuals in the early stages of polio, which was a significant health concern during the 1950s. This machine helped patients breathe when the virus paralyzed their chest muscles. In this touching photo, a woman is seen looking over at her newborn baby while lying inside the iron lung. Number 19. Feet First during World War II, British soldiers of the 7th Armored Division in North Africa endured long desert treks. These challenging conditions took a toll on the soldiers' feet. To address potential foot issues early on, regular foot inspections became part of their daily routine. Number 18. I Spy This photo from 1941 showcases a young boy undergoing an eye inspection. To get a closer look at his eye, a nurse used a magnifying glass. While this procedure may not have been unusual, the presence of the magnifying glass adds an intriguing and somewhat intimidating element to the process. Number 17. A Whole New World Have you ever wondered who assembled those globes of the world that you'd find in the back of a classroom? This photo from 1941 provides insight into the mounting department of a firm where women were tasked with affixing the continents to schoolroom globes. Philips is one of the oldest globe manufacturers in the world. Before the digital age and Google Maps, these women played a crucial role in helping students pinpoint the locations of countries around the world. Number 16. Real World Games in 1941, during a time when air raids and bombings were part of children's daily lives, some children engaged in pretend play by imagining themselves as air raid protection and first aid parties. This photo features a group of children dressed up for their roles and even creating a casualty clearing station as part of their imaginative play. Number 15. Disneyland Back in the Day Disneyland has always been the epitome of magic, and this vintage photo captures a group of children experiencing the enchantment of the California Amusement Park in its opening year, 1955. These children board an old-fashioned stagecoach pulled by horses. As the park had just opened in 1955, these children got to visit during its first year. Number 14. Made to Milk this photograph captures a practice session in Germany, where milkmaids honed their skills on fake udders before approaching a real cow's udder. Women would sit around a plastic udder attached to a table and simulate the milking process. Number 13. Backstage Ballerina Margot Fontaine, a renowned British ballet dancer, is pictured backstage as she prepares to perform in a production of The Nutcracker, at La Scala in Milan, Italy. Tchaikovsky's classic Christmas-themed ballet, first performed in 1892 in St. Petersburg, continues to be a beloved and enduring production. Number 12. Vintage Beauty Beauty pageants have a long history, as seen in this photo of Viola Davis sitting on a throne of flowers after winning a beauty contest in Hollywood, California. The first recorded international beauty pageant was held in 1888 in Belgium. Number 11. Flight Attendants Pose Flight attendants Marilyn Spillane and Rebecca Armstrong strike a pose inside a Rolls-Royce engine of a Lockheed L-1011 TriStar airliner. This photo was taken while the flight attendants were attending the Paris Air Show in France in 1971. Number 10. Nurse Advertisement This vintage ad from 1943 aimed to recruit nurses during World War II. The poster features a young nurse standing over a male patient, with text that reads, Save his life and find your own. Be a nurse. Number 9. Baby Nurse Young children often engage in imaginative play. And in this heartwarming photo, a young girl named Carol Shepard plays pretend as a Red Cross nurse. She carefully tends to her patient, a baby doll with a bandage, and even offers the doll a drink of water. Number 8. Vietnam War Protest 
Amid the controversy surrounding the Vietnam War, mass protests began in 1965, primarily on college campuses in the U.S. While most anti-war demonstrations were centered in the U.S., other countries also held protests in solidarity. In this photograph, a group of protesters takes to the streets in Amsterdam, showing support for the anti-war cause. Number 7. Dog Duties Dogs have long been known as man's best friend, and this heartwarming photograph captures a caring dog attempting to feed a crying baby by holding a milk bottle in its mouth. While the dog's efforts might not have been successful in feeding the baby, the gesture and the photo itself create an endearing moment. Number 6. Nurses on a Carousel Even nurses deserve moments of fun and relaxation, as seen in this photo from 1917. A group of nurses enjoys a carefree ride on a carousel at a fair that benefited wounded soldiers in Sitkup. Despite the passage of time, the carousel in the photograph closely resembles those enjoyed by children today. Number 5. Prisoner Holds the Paper In this stark photo from 1972, Prisoner Elmer Branch holds out a newspaper for other death row inmates to read at the Texas State Penitentiary. Only Branch's arms and the Houston Chronicle newspaper are visible through the cell bars. Number 4. Trapped Snowplow This photograph captures the challenges posed by a particularly harsh snowstorm in Amesbury, Wiltshire, England in 1927. Even a locomotive snowplow found itself trapped in the snow, and a group of residents attempted to free it by shoveling away the snow. Number 3. The London Zoo Welcomes a New Member The London Zoo welcomed a delightful addition in the form of a baby polar bear in this adorable photograph. A zookeeper proudly shows off the newborn bear, named Brumus, to cameras and press members who came to greet the newest member of the zoo. Brumus became a star and returned to his mother after this public debut. Number 2. The Statue of Liberty Head the Statue of Liberty, an iconic symbol of hope and freedom, was actually created in France and gifted to the U.S. as a present. In this photograph from 1878, the head of the statue was displayed in Paris, France, before it was transported to the United States in 1885. Number 1. Prisoners Playing Chess This striking photo offers a unique perspective on prison life in the 1970s. Two inmates engage in a game of chess through their prison cell bars at Attica Correctional Facility in New York in 1972. The photo focuses on the chessboard, the inmates' hands, and the cell bars, with the prisoners remaining anonymous. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey through history's hidden photos. If you enjoyed this glimpse into the past, don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more fascinating content.